Arthur. Help me. Brotherly love. Oh, brother. Brother! Where art thou? Let me tell you something, brother. Brah! All right, now that one's stretching it. Okay, that's not as easy as it looks. Is the younger one the musically talented? <sighs> Why doesn't that surprise me? No, kid, you got... You got aspirations for being a bar. Nope. Turn, 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 turn. There we go. And... No, just, just walking through the water. Did the bridge matter at all? Seemingly not. Hey, drunkard, can we get through? What good is a tree to me, the man without a shoe? Woo! That kid's gonna be a drunken bard at this rate. Well, okay. Hey, I thought we were going to be going uh, more consistently down this area. Or I guess I either expected us to already be out of the town area or to have stayed more consistently in a town area. The first boss fight of the game. Oh, I'm gonna have to... Okay, I can dig this. And this is actually much easier to control than our earlier areas have been because I've been trying to coordinate th with both of them at the same time. Let me check the kit chicken. Chicken? Nope. All right, all right. Hey, I had to go check that, uh... It's not even a chicken coop, technically. It's just an area with chickens. Okay, I'm gonna jump to this one, of course. Actually, I don't even know why I swapped to him first. Okay, just kept going with that. I think the dog was walking away actually, and I just made that worse. Dog, what are you doing? That is some serious camping right there, dog. Okay, first boss fight taken care of. I mean, it's so funny and so simple, but really, if there weren't the two of them, and assuming that dog would have been them, they really would have been screwed right there. Assuming all these other simple town navigation areas could have been handled by just the one of them because you know it's walking through town eh. thankfully you can just hold and not actually have to like time anything oh i recognize this solution brother boost and drop the rope. Well, thankfully his mom didn't hang himself for, you know, walking home to find that. That might have been a little more traumatic. I feel like this could be a section that would get you killed. 
<laughs> like really easily. What? Oh, I saw something much more sinister at first. I thought that cluster of black bunnies was like a spider. And I was like, what the hell am I looking at? What direction in fresh hell did this game suddenly take? Nope, just bunnies. Well, he's the one who was whistling at birds earlier. Oh. Well then. Okay. Oh. Gotta get those snapshots. Scenic farmland. Okay, so they really went inland quite a good deal. Because now, no coast land, no coast uh, that I can foresee. I like how they're just casually chilling out. And honestly, what's funny too is that these look like just park benches. And they're located in such interesting areas. It's like, take a load off. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I thought it was, you know, going to stay down. Is he going to, like... Um... Okay, I'm moving a sheep. And frankly, I don't really know why. Do I pop the sheep in here? Is this my first instinct? Haha! -ha! Animal labor. I am okay with this. Because honestly, what are animals good for if not a little slave labor? How would you get back? When you have just kind of trapped your... When you... Mm, I am mixing up my direction so bad. Wouldn't that have really like screwed you over royally? Oh, he did get up. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that would have really screwed you over sliding down that area, and how do you get back? I'm guessing they're just going for either a little bit of bark or root sample, so they shouldn't need anything too crazy. So, I mean, this wouldn't be a hard part to get back through, for instance, but... <laughs> I hope you're not hungry for kids. <laughs> okay, they are appropriately freaked out. This is unusual. I guess? I mean, he's living right above a normal farm. You can't be that bad, right? I mean, this is definitely a permanent establishment he's in. Oh, I've seen that planet. You just jump up there. Can we help you first? Uh... Okay, we're just following the leader. Okay. Well, I haven't had my life changed too far just yet. But, uh... It's usually the last act where things get funky. Oh. Okay. Oh! oh that was unexpected. Genuinely, I did... I did not expect that. Okay. We couldn't have just... We couldn't have walked up that? 
I feel like we could have walked up that. Would have been, you know, ten times safer. But, you know, I've always already thought that once or twice now. Oh, okay, maybe this area we couldn't have handled so easily. Man, this is some pretty precarious areas to navigate for a couple of kids. And even if it wasn't... Again, how in the world are you supposed to get back? Oh, yeah, he's coming. I can read the shadows. I can see. And again, you gotta... Shadows and uh, perspective made him seem like he was even more freakishly huge. Man, he got over what was he was crying about pretty quick, I have to admit. That did not take him very long. Because he is just trooping right along. I mean, he is darn helpful. No wonder the people who live underneath him don't bat an eye. And yes, I do have to ask, what is up with the mushrooms? I mean, they're just growing out of him. I want to say he's just like an ogre or a troll, but... You know, that's a little uncommon. Alright, we can... Wait, what? Can I not climb up the... the roots? You kinda lost me here, game. Did something screw up? Feel like something might have just screwed up. Well... I'm gonna... I was doing so well with the controls too for a while. Uh. Oh, gosh dang it. I think something really did screw up. Okay, well, I'm going to pause here and come back to this game a little bit later, but this is somewhat of a test recording. I am treating this as my first Let's Play, but again, I've never recorded for video game footage this way before, so we're going to see how it turns out. And hope you've enjoyed the videos thus far and we'll get back to brothers soon as always folks fruit and doggy